The H1N1 influenza pandemic scare of 2009 was a challenge for many jurisdictions. Vaccine shortages, long lines and conflicting information exposed issues in planning and coordination among some agencies responsible for vaccine programs. While experiencing some of these same issues, the province of Saskatchewan was better prepared for shipping and receiving pandemic vaccine due to a lean transformation in their vaccine program. Although the project was in the early stages, a team had already freed up plenty of space for the pandemic vaccines, and a strong teamwork culture emerged. Furthermore, an improved inventory system reduction found savings of $1.7 million that helped offset costs of H1N1. Problems of flow are common in most environments. Establishing flow with minimal inventory and waste is a key goal of lean practices. According to Tyler Chiddenton, business management consultant, Saskatchewan Ministry of Health, nearly $1 million of waste was happening every year in the vaccine program, caused either by expired products or products exposed to unsafe temperatures. The breakthrough was, first, to identify the root cause of the problem, a major bottleneck, and then to eliminate that step entirely. Vaccines were being shipped to government services, waiting for a courier, being shipped to regional public health offices, and then being repackaged and sent out to the smaller satellite clinics. The team found a way to ship directly from the ministry to the clinics, cutting waste well beyond the 50% target that the team had set. This was a big win and set the tone for future team cooperation and buy-in. On your lean journey, there will be many opportunities to improve flow in administrative areas, in the lab, and of most importance, directly in patient care. Value stream mapping can help identify the processes that cannot meet client demand. Kaizen events are scheduled to systematically remove the blockages and establish flow. Standard lean tools such as 5S, visual controls, and mistake proofing together with attention to layout for flow and flexible staffing are then used to make the value flow. This course will introduce you to flow and help you understand how the various tools and techniques are applied to achieve and maintain it. Let's meet tact time.